Hey crafters, it is summer. You know what that means. That means it is time to tie dye. I think tie dye should be worn year round personally, but summer is a great time to do projects because they can be messy. You can do them outside. And of course, who doesn't love some new fun bright clothes to celebrate the season? So I've got my sister's help. She's gonna be doing some tie dye with me. We went to the thrift store, we got some fun pieces, and then we went to the craft store and got some like scarves and like pencil cases and you know, stuff like that to dye. So I think we're just gonna dive in, try to get some of this tie dye on the pieces this evening and just jump right in. We're using some tie dye kits from Tulip and the little squeezy bottles. Fill them up with water and dye, shake them around, get it on the garments, and then you gotta let them sit for about six to eight hours. So we're gonna probably let ours sit overnight in their plastic bags and then we'll wash them out tomorrow morning. So should be a really fun process. I'm not talking through the how-tos and the dyeing process so much for this project just because we've done a lot of tie-dye videos on this channel. So if you want a little more like how-to, maybe you've never done this before, I'll link down below to the video I made when I first tried a tie-dye kit like the one we're using today. And I'll talk you through how my experience went and some of the tips that I picked up then. But we're gonna show you uh, some of our thrift store shopping and then We'll dive right in, do a little tie dye, and then tomorrow we'll wash all the stuff out and show you how it worked. So, hope you enjoy just coming along on this fun summer adventure. Hopefully it'll be bright colored and awesome by the time we're done. But hey, it's tie dye. You never know what's going to happen, but it is always fun. So, let's get tie dyeing and uh, we'll show you how it goes.
take one. 